Hello! Birdman316 here again. Same day, we just traded guitars. We just looked at that one right there. Now, we're looking at this one. I did a tabletop chatter about this one. This is the Donner DLP-124. It is, yes, we all know, that it is a Les Paul Special 2 clone, the Epiphone clone. If you notice that uh, there's something a little different here. Yep, I got cream-colored pickups in here. Cream, cream-colored uh, bobbins. These are from Guitar Madness. Now, I wasn't too sure about the bridge one. Now, I was planning on putting another bridge one in here and doing a coil split. I thought, well, I'll, I'll do the coil split on another guitar. I want to have this one mostly, I guess, uh, as it would have came from the factory. Just regular, no coil splits, no nothing. Just full humbuckers on both. You notice that these are staggered. I got the base side sunk down and the treble side raised up. It does have a lot to do with dynamic dynamics. Well, let's see if we can get down here and look. They're not too close to the strings. But this one here I know that I just ordered this a few weeks ago. This is a Guitar Madness 57 Special. I wasn't sure about this one, but then I got to looking. The measurement's like 8.4-ish. I think the neck one is like a 7.5. I got to looking in the catalog of Guitar Madness, and guess what? This just happens to be by weird luck a 57 special as well so uh, what, what do you know it just happens to be a mated pair now in the donna yep it's still five strings and one of them popped when i was tuning on it the other day i will get I'll just miles replace all five of them. Well, all five of them now. The sixth one decided to go on strike, but anyway. I will take care of this. But in the meantime, I will get some weights and whatnot up there. Probably at the end of this film. And the next time you see this, I will be doing a sound demonstration with the new pickups. Now, don't expect these vintage wound pickups to be really, really hot, which they're not. They're vintage wound. I guess they're 50, late 50s era, 57 specials. So you know what I mean? 57 special, 1957, late 50s, right? But anyway, there it is. Now, as far as any more modding on this one, it's not going to be happening because other than replacing parts that may go bad, wear out, whatever, I will, I will replace the strings. Let's take a quick look at some. These cream bobbin pickups goes nicely with the binding around the neck. Of course, the headstock's got binding around it too. And cream colored switch tip, the, the poker chip. And these gold knobs are staying on here as well. It just, I, it just compliments. It. it looks sort of like the bow tie type thing. It just really makes the guitar really pop even better now. There you go. Let's get a thumbnail. There you go. Thumbnail snap. There we go. All right, guys. This is Birdman316. I hope everyone has a wonderful day, wonderful night, wherever you may be. And always remember, rock out your Les Paul, rock out your Fender, rock out whatever you got. Make the world a better place. Sayonara. Seven pounds, two ounces. Or 
3.25 kilograms. Seven pounds, three ounces, or 3.26 kilograms.